Meanwhile, American media reporting that a San Diego-based firm has already developed a vaccine which may be available as early as summer. Millions remain isolated and quarantined in China as the number of confirmed cases has now gone beyond 60,000. The WHO also had recently announced that a vaccine may take as long as 18 months. However, latest reports suggesting that San Diego-based firm Innovo Pharmaceuticals is on its way to producing a much-needed vaccine for the virus. The company has already tested the vaccine on mice and guinea pigs, and it will soon also be tried on a group of human patients. The firm claims that it developed the vaccine for COVID-19 within three hours after Chinese scientists released the genetic sequence on the 9th of January, following which the vaccine was produced and tests were conducted. Researchers hope that the vaccine will tell the body to attack the virus in the form of antibodies and T-cells, thus curing the patient. Scientists hope that this form of biological software will prove to be effective in defeating the virus. Meanwhile, the WHO has warned that any apparent slowdown in the coronavirus outbreak must be viewed with extreme caution. The global health body said that while the number of COVID-19 cases in China has now stabilized, the disease continues to spread to new countries. We definitely see uh, that the behavior of the virus uh, outside, outside Wuhan, Hubei, in the rest of China, and outside China uh, doesn't appear at this point to be as aggressive or as accelerated, and that's a good sign. And that gives us an opportunity to, to prepare and to react, and still gives us the opportunity for containment and potential interruption of transmission of the virus. Uh, but that's no guarantee. It's not a guarantee. Uh, but we must continue to try to stop the virus while preparing countries for the arrival of the virus. WHO also warned that there is a greater risk of the virus spreading to countries with weak health systems. The number of newly confirmed cases reported from China has stabilized over the past week. But that's to be, that must be interpreted with extreme caution. This outbreak could still go in any direction. Our greatest fear remains the damage this coronavirus could do in a country like the RC. Even as the flames of one outbreak begin to die down, we're fighting another fire front.